Hey everyone, it has been a very, very busy day in the Weather Center with a tremendous amount of flooding and flash flooding that was happening all across the state. The rain tapering off through this evening and the flooding threat is diminishing, which is good news. Still a flash flood or a flood watch, I should say, up until around 2 o'clock in the morning. Those showers will push to the east, will dry things up overnight tonight. Still sky high levels of humidity, some fog as we start out the day. Smoke returning for tomorrow, but also the heat as well. So we'll get a haze from the heat and that smoke. Wouldn't surprise me if an air quality alert gets issued as a result of that. Temperatures in the 80s to around 90 degrees for the afternoon. The weather will stay dry the next couple of days. We'll get a pop storm or two Tuesday and then maybe Friday. Those are the best chances for scattered showers and storms. Uh, the shoreline temperature right about where it should be for this time of the year. But the overnight low temperatures are really, really mild for any time of the year. This is the pretty much warmest week of weather for the entire year on average and lots of days where temperatures are in the 80s. Humidity level comes down a little bit as we head closer towards the weekend. We're looking at temperatures that are back into the uh, mid 60s for the overnight low temperatures. Scattered shower and storm threat for some of the days, primarily again for Tuesday and Friday. Hey, keep an eye to the sky uh, for a couple more showers that come through and also an eye to the ground as we watch more floodwaters rushing from the north down towards us. Areas along the Connecticut River will definitely have those floodwaters rising for the next couple of days.